Hello and welcome to today's DirectX 11 benchmarking video. This video is a follow up to the Vulkan API benchmarking video which I have done in the past. I will be comparing how Rainbow Six Siege runs on the Vulkan API and the DirectX 11 in another video. So if you want to check out that video then be sure to subscribe. In this video I have benchmarked my system on Rainbow Six Siege starting from low settings and going all the way up to high settings. If you happen to have a similar system and I want you to know if you can run Rainbow Six Siege then this video is for you. Just to make the video as short and concise as possible for the viewers, I will try not to repeat information that I've already stated in the previous video, so do refer to the video if you need to. Also, a crucial point that I missed out in my last video was that if you turn on G-Sync or V-Sync, then this will cause less tearing but increased input lag. For casual gamers like me, turning v on shouldn't be much of a problem, but for competitive gamers who play in Pro Leagues for example, they have V-Sync turned off at all times. If you want to go competitive, then play on low settings and don't lock FPS to your monitor's refresh rate. This will cause a bit of tearing, but it will definitely reduce input lag. Thank you. 
If you found this video useful, then be sure to give it a like and also share it with your friends who might also find this video useful. Thanks for watching, I will see you in the next one.